Nuzlocke bringing you guys the first episode of our Pokemon Greylock and this is basically our ROM where well this is basically gonna be a series not a ROM this is basically is gonna be a series where we play through all the Drayana hacks and um yeah just Nuzlocke them like usual I have actually never tried a Drano hack so I'm really excited for this one. I personally spoke to Drano and I was like, uh, I think I'm gonna do this and he's like, you're quite up for a challenge so yeah, uh, I, why am I naming myself Drano? I, I'm supposed to name myself offline. Drano is our, Drano is gonna be our, our rival. Um, so yeah, if you guys are new to this channel make sure you guys hit the subscribe button and also if you're enjoying make sure you hit the like button because we are going to be having some fun in this series. Uh, we, I'll probably think of something cool and something dumb and lose a lot of mon. So if you're hyped for that, make sure you guys uh, maybe, you know, drop a subscribe, uh, watch out for the videos, hit the bell, comment what your favorite starter is because I know what the starters are for this and oh boy, we're in for a treat. Um, I think the choice is very real, uh, clear. Uh, and then, yeah, so we're gonna go with, uh, let's see, so this is Magby, and this is Smoochum, so you should guess what the last one is, it's Elekid, so we're going with our boy Elekid, which is really energetic, so we're gonna name him In Charge, which is my usual name for my Zero Aura, but in this generation we're not gonna get a Zero Aura, so we're gonna put Elekid In Charge of the squad, because it's my secondary slash spirit mod um so yeah in charge it is and then uh it's gonna be in charging the whole series and um it's fast flow nature so it's neutral with static which is really good because it can paralyze on contact obviously so if you guys don't know what a news lock is uh the basic rules we catch the pokemon on the first route we nickname every single pokemon and uh we we don't let them die because once they faint, they're actually released or put in the box named Rip because rest in peace with them. So you only get one chance with the Mons and that's when you, it starts when you get the Pokeballs. So we're going to make sure that we're good to go. I know this, uh, this ROM hack is supposed to be really uh, difficult and uh, this is my first time playing the ROM hack. So yeah, it's going to be a, it's going to be a doozy as I say. And we one shot that hood hood, which is a good thing, but we need to make sure that we are leveled up before we get the Pokeballs. So I'm gonna I'm gonna Ooh do duo that that's actually a good mon that we can actually try to get. And Rotatus. And that's pretty much it I think on this route because like you can only have like three or four encounter tape like encounters per route or I'm not sure. I, I haven't done any ROM hack. Oh, it's centric, so probably not. But there's gonna be a variety of mods we can get, so hopefully we get lucky with the uh, with the encounter pools, because we're gonna need something busted right off the bat to defeat Brock, because we chose an electric type like a Pikachu. So we're gonna be in 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 a little bit of a, you know, Ponyta. I need the boy Ponyta. Ponyta is actually kind of overlooked. Uh, by me personally, it was overlooked until I used it, which was, oh my goodness, the first time I used Pondita, I was like, it's gonna be garbage, and then I got to the Elite Four, and it just started destroying half of the stuff, so, uh, my opinions changed, but, yeah, that's what, that's what happens when you don't try them on, so, we're gonna tr make sure we have, um, we know what we're using, just be careful, and I think I'm gonna get the Pokeballs, cause I would like to get the encounters, and I'll, I'll make sure to do the like, grinding off screen, and make sure to like get you guys a good series. I will try to edit out half of the stuff that doesn't need to be in there. I think I'm gonna get to level eight before I get the Pokeballs, because I I'm feeling very safe. I know you have to be really safe in this Nuzlocke, and crits are something that destroy everything. And one thing. If you don't know about me or haven't watched the Soul Silver, crits are my demise. Uh, we lost the lock because of the crits. Like, crits at the worst time possible. And I feel like this route is gonna be really good. Like, it has a really good pull. And we can get potential very good mods. So, I'm ready. And I see a 
our boy Congo. So hopefully we get something really good. And yeah, let's get to it. Uh, we get we get our Pokeballs now. Custom some Pokeballs. This Professor Oak is he knows what we are talking about. So yeah, this is gonna be a really good episode because you know we're going at it. And yeah, let's go. So I'm gonna heal up first of all because why not and then we're gonna get the town map as uh, I don't usually do this but why not you know so yeah let's take the town map and here's our first encounter I'm gonna go in this patch of grass and it's gonna be a hoot so yeah let's catch it I I'm gonna try to throw just a pokeball at it and see what happens and yeah we'll go okay so it just broke out so I'm gonna oh it grout which is really good because I can quick attack and it did okay we got it static we are good to go i think i'm gonna catch it now let's go we caught the hoot hoot now yeah uh i don't know what to nickname it we'll okay, so um i'm not sure what to name the hoot hoot i'm gonna probably name it specter because that sounds like a cool nickname and specter is like uh he has kind of specs so specter it is you, you guys should totally leave uh, nicknames down below and I'll try to nickname it uh, if possible. I'll probably be a little bit ahead of uh, the episodes, so just wait, be patient, I'll get the nickname soon. And now we can we have to buy potions because uh, we're going to need them, but first of all, I'm getting 10 Pokeballs and a Premier Ball. Wait, we didn't get Premier Balls, what the heck. I'm getting the Antidote. And then we don't need the paralyzed heal because we're fine. And then, oh, I see a grass. Hold on. Yeah, there was grass. So we can get an encounter in the city, which is really good. I think I'm gonna snag that encounter to be honest. We're gonna need. Oh, it's a route. So let's go. Okay, I'm just gonna throw a Pokeball because if it teleports, it's gonna. Oh, it has confusion. Okay. I'm gonna throw another Pokeball and try my luck. Okay, we caught the rod, so let's go. And, uh, yeah, let's get this on the rail. And okay, so we have our rods, we caught it, and we are gonna name it Grace, because that's what I usually name my rods. And this is gonna be a good one. This is a good encounter. I am very hyped to use this, use this mod. I usually use the rods uh, whenever I'm playing through a Johto game, and it's a jolly nature, which is not that good, but we'll be fine. It's not bad. And we, our, our hoot hoot is lonely, so our team is gonna make sure that the hoot hoot is not lonely anymore. Uh, Jolly Nature kinda sucks, but it's fine. We'll work with it. Now we have our Route 22 encounter, which is gonna be amazing too, because why not? And it's a Mankey, which is, I, I am actually really excited about Mankey, because this is gonna really help us against Brock and his Rock types. So let's go, we got the Mankey, and um. We can nickname it Dahlia because why not? So I'm gonna nickname the Mankey Dahlia and yeah. right, so let's check out our Mankey now because we caught it and it's level five which is really good. It has a naive nature with vital spirit, so we're gonna have to get a, a fighting type move on our Mankey, but this this team is working really good and we are almost gonna have a team of six. I'm gonna try to have a team of six before we take on the next episode so yeah let's do that and we got a oh we oh he's gonna show us how to do this this is in the normal pokemon games i'm like do we have to actually battle him that that would be kind of cool not gonna lie but yeah i see a i see a guy who is not usually here and he gives us a old rod i should have gotten that because i would love a flying um water type and this house is kind of new, so I'm going to go ahead and see what's going on in here. And nicknames. Okay. Yeah, I do usually nickname my Pokemon, so you don't have to tell me that. Oh, we might be able to get a Quick Law, which would be amazing. But, no, that doesn't happen until uh, the Halloween game. So, we're going to move on. Hopefully, Route 2 has some water for us. And there is no water for us. But this, this girl right here, a trainer, please take this Pokemon. Ooh, let's go. We got a treacle, boys. 
guys, so we got a Trico, and I'm gonna name it Reptar as I usually do. I have nicknames for a lot of Pokemons, and let me tell you, I have a dog for all the nicknames that I have stored. And Reptar the Trico is gonna be on the team, and it's gonna be level 10. It's gonna be the highest, highest level mon on our team with the gentle nature with Overgrow, Pound Absorb, and Leer. So our team is actually really stacked right now, and I am really happy with our team right now. Thanks Triana for making the encounters really good, but as you guys know, his ROMs are going to be really hard because look at the encounters we have had so far. So I'm going to take the liberty and go to the forest and get the encounter and that's where we can end the episode. But yeah, we got a Weedle, I will take this actually because um, it's a really good mon, so let's catch the Weedle quickly. And we caught the Weedle, which is amazing. Yeah, we have the Weedle, and we are gonna name it Stingy, cause it's stingy as, as a, as a bee, 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 whatever. So it's a, it's a stingy Weedle. So we're gonna name it Stingy, and there we go. We have our team of six. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this episode. I'm gonna head back to the Pokemon Center and. If you did, comment down below, Reptar, if you have watched them now, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.